Hey, what up you guys? This is Danny B. You're watching the Trash Dash. And uh, it's kind of late at night, so I'm keeping it quiet. But here's some recent stuff I picked up. And uh, here we go. Alright, first up from Goodwill. I found Greystone Park. It's kind of found footage movie with um, ghosts in a mental asylum or something like that. Heard this is pretty good, and it's by uh, Oliver Stone's son. And I think Oliver Stone is in this movie. Yeah, there he is right there. Hey, Greystone Park. Alright, next up from uh, Big Lots, I found the ABCs of Death. And this one kind of has a cult following because it was on Netflix for like three years or something. And if you bring this up to um, people that watch a lot of like movies on Netflix, they'll know this one. Yeah, ABCs of Death, kind of like a anthology movie with featuring letters of the alphabet. Kind of a weird movie, but it's pretty decent. Alright, then next up I found Starship Troopers, Traitors of Mars. And this is, I think, the fourth movie in the series or something. This one was also done in animation. Um, Bronco Juggalo just sent me the uh, the other one. The one before this was also animation. So this is cool to find this right afterwards. Yeah, Starship Troopers, Traitors of Mars. All right, next up from Big Lots, I found Apartment 143. It's another kind of like paranormal movie or something. Uh, it says paranormal activity in just about every possible possible way, but with way more action. So that sounds cool. Three books. All right, next up from Big Lots, I found Bad Milo. I uh, heard a lot of good things about this. Haven't seen it yet. Some kind of like killer puppet movie or something. I didn't realize it was rated R. I thought it was like PG-13. So, yeah, Bad Milo. Next up from Goodwill, I found uh, Wild Things on VHS. The Nev Campbell and uh, Denise Richards. Some kind of thriller. You know, I actually never saw this one. Um, I know a lot of people love this one. Never seen it. And I also found Wild Things Foursome Part 4. Never saw this one either. <laughs> uh, this is actually, uh, I took it out of the case to put it in storage. I just store them like this. Yeah, a lot of things for on DVD. Alright, next up I found a Dollar Tree uh, Storage 24. Some kind of like demon movie. And it kind of reminded me of Pumpkin Head right there on the uh, bag, so I picked it up. I guess some guy trapped in a storage unit or something. Next up from uh, Dollar Tree, I found Forest of Death. Some kind of Japanese horror movie. Don't know what this is, but I like the the cover. You can see that it's got kind of like a um, like a chameleon type of metal on the cover or something. Like, see how that changes colors? Forest of Death. All right, then next up from Big Lot, I got three. Uh, Kind of like scream, scream era horror movies. I found Fear.com. Yeah, this is about a killer website or something. Actually, never saw this one, but Fear.com. Then uh, Swim Fan. And I actually hear a lot of good things about Swim Fan. I saw it back in the day. I don't remember it too much though. But yeah, Swim Fan. And then last up, I found Valentine, which is pretty good. Uh, Pretty good slasher movie with also has Denise Richards in there. And what cracks me up is that this is set in San Francisco, but it looks nothing like San Francisco. You can tell it's Canada. But yeah, that's what I get. Alright you guys, this is Danny B. You're watching the trash dash. I hope you like that haul. Let me know which one of these is your favorite one. Alright. Make sure to hit the like button, comment, and subscribe. Peace out.